Hi folks, Vince here. I'm going to show you how to create a manual booking with uh, price breakdown, including taxes, extra guest charges, and uh, correct nightly rate. Um, so the first, things, uh, first thing we need to do is set up um, our taxes and uh, extra fees correctly. So if I go into a listing here, um, my modern apartment listing, um, under pricing, uh, here we can set the extra guest charges. So I have an uh, extra guest charge of £20 per night for each guest after two with a maximum of nine guests. So that means that the third guest will get charged £20 um, and the next one, the next one and so on. Uh, we also can set taxes and fees here on the pricing taxes and fees tabs, tab. Um, and what I have here is a property rent tax, which is like a VAT, and that's a percentage of the subtotal. We have a fixed tax per reservation, so uh, this is just a like a um, regardless of the length of stay, um, it could be a city tax you might have. Um, we have a fixed guest tax per person per night. So if we have five guests uh, over five nights, they'll be charged ten pound per guest per night. And then we have a fixed nightly tax, which I don't have set here, but I'll just set one for uh, demonstration purposes of uh, £20, that is. Okay, so those, those taxes are now set in place. I'm going to create a booking from the 22nd of January through to the 25th. And the rate that I am going to set that at is 190 is fine, 170 is fine. Um, but I've agreed that this price is going to be um, 180 So I just set that here. And all I need to do is drag and drop the date that I want to uh, check out. You can I can now see there's a new booking panel is created or is displayed here. And I have four guests. I need, so this, this shows that the, the price breakdown based on those inputs of taxes and fees and the nightly rate um, plus the extra guest charges. Um, I can now apply a discount or add extra charges. Um, so I know this guest um, is a frequent um, visitor and I offer them a £20 discount um, just for booking directly with me. And you'll see this display uh, immediately on the price breakdown. Um, but I also need to charge extra for um, airport collection. That is £80. So this is my price, break, price breakdown. Um, I have my accommodation total is 540, um, which is around, which is exactly 180 pounds um, average per night. Uh, I have a discount of 20 pounds. I have the airport collection of 80 pounds. I have my extra guest charges, which is two extra guests at 20 pounds each, um, which makes my subtotal. Uh, my taxes are then uh, added on top of, of that subtotal. So we have a 10% tax uh, reservation event tax, which is 64. Reservation tax, person tax, that's the number of guests times number of nights times the uh, tax I have in place, and then a nightly tax. They also, also have set for £20, I believe. So that's my total, the total fee for the guest, total price for the guest is now £924. I click the next step and enter the guest name, which is James Jones. And I have an email address. Uh, phone number, sorry, is uh, email address is james.jones.gmail.com. And that is it. That booking has now been created. It's here on the calendar. I can select it and I can see the uh, price breakdown as agreed. Um, if for whatever reason you go in and change this uh, price here um, to say 100, um, that will not be reflected in the booking. Um, this booking is correct at the time of booking. All the prices are in place um, at that time of booking. Um, this is the, the right way to do it. If for whatever reason you, you need to change the price or something went wrong, um, go and delete the booking and create it again. So that is how to create a manual booking with uh, taxes, fees, extra guest charges, discounts, and uh, added charges with the nightly rate included. Um, give it a go.